Hey there, it's Ryan. Have you ever been super excited to pop your SIM card into a new phone, only to be hit with a frustrating message saying your phone's locked to a specific carrier? That's a real buzzkill, isn't it? Well, in today's video, we're diving into the nitty gritty of carrier locks, those pesky barriers that keep you from using your phone with different network providers. And guess what? We're not just talking iPhones. These tricks work for Android devices too. Now, you might be wondering why these locks exist in the first place. It's usually because phones are often sold at discounted prices or on payment plans tied to a specific carrier. But hey, life's too short to be tethered to one network, right? Especially when you're traveling abroad or just hunting for a better deal. So sit tight. I'm going to walk you through some super simple methods to free your phone from these carrier constraints. And the best part? These methods are universal. Whether you're in the US, trekking through the mountains in Nepal, or just chilling in your backyard, these steps will work for any carrier, anywhere in the world. This isn't just a one-trick pony. It's your golden ticket to network freedom. Let's get started. Keep in mind, this guide is for legit use only. It's meant for folks who truly own their phones and are looking to switch networks. We're not about encouraging any dodgy behavior, like tampering with devices that aren't yours. Make sure to stay on the right side of the law and respect others' property. And of course, we're playing by YouTube's playbook and keeping things above board. Now that we've got that straight, let's get back to it. Quick note, the unlock services we're discussing mainly work in first world countries. If you're not in one of those countries or prefer not to use these services, don't worry, we've got you covered. Every week, we're giving away 250 unlocks to our viewers. To enter, it's super easy. First, hit that like button on this video and make sure you're subscribed to our channel and drop a comment below with your phone's model, like iPhone 13A, your IMEI number, and your country. That's it. As soon as you've done these steps, you're in the draw. Stay tuned to see if you've won. Let's dive into how you can use Carrier Switcher to unlock your phone. First up, head over to CarrierSwitcher.com. There, you'll find a green button to kick things off. Clicking it takes you to the Online Carrier Unlocker app. Now they'll need a bit of info to get things rolling. Start by entering your name and email. Make sure to use an email you actually check because they're going to send you a confirmation code you'll need later. Next up, choose the manufacturer of your phone, like Samsung or Apple. Then comes the crucial part, entering your IMEI number. If you're not sure how to find it, it's pretty simple. Just dial star hashtag 06 hashtag on your phone and the number should pop up on your screen. Before you hit that continue button, you'll need to confirm that you're playing by the rules. This means agreeing to their terms of service and making sure you're not trying to unlock a phone that's not rightfully yours. Once you tap continue, you're nearly there. They'll confirm your unlock is ready and send you an email with all the details. This email is super important because it contains your access key. You'll use this key to start your order. And the great thing is, you can use it as many times as you want for unlimited downloads. Finally, if you're wondering how to use that access key, don't worry. The email will guide you through the next steps. Just follow the instructions and you'll be all set. Aside from using unlocking services, there are other ethical and legal ways to remove a carrier lock from your phone. First, you can directly contact your carrier. Most carriers will unlock your phone for free if you've completed your contract or paid off your phone. Just give them a call or visit their website. They might ask for some details like your account information and the IMEI number of your phone. Another option is to use a third-party unlocking service, but make sure it's a reputable one. These services can unlock your phone for a fee. You provide your phone's IMEI number, make a payment, and they'll send you the unlock code. Just be cautious, research the service thoroughly, and check reviews to avoid scams. If you've got a bit of technical know-how, you might consider unlocking the phone yourself. Some online guides and tools can walk you through this process. However, this can be a bit risky. If something goes wrong, it might void your warranty, or worse, brick your phone. So, this method is best left to tech-savvy users who understand the risks. Lastly, some newer phones might not even have a carrier lock, especially if you bought them directly from the manufacturer or paid full price at a retail store. If you suspect your phone isn't locked, just try a SIM card from a different carrier. If it works, you're all set. Remember, whichever method you choose, make sure it's legal and ethical. 
Respecting the law and the terms of your contract is crucial. And that wraps up our guide. Thanks so much for watching. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more content like this. Got any questions or did everything work out smoothly for you? Drop us a comment below. We'd love to hear from you. Your feedback is what keeps us going. Until next time, take care.